Look up at the night sky. Among the stars, some lights are our planetary neighbors, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, and Saturn. But beyond what we can see lies Neptune, the most distant planet in our solar system. Through a telescope, Neptune is just a faint blue dot, a ghostly world at the edge of sunlight. Neptune takes 165 years to orbit the sun. No one alive at its discovery has seen it complete a full circle. Sunlight there is 900 times dimmer than on Earth, casting Neptune in perpetual twilight. Yet this distant world is alive with storms and secrets. For centuries, our map of the solar system ended with Uranus. Neptune changed that. It was the first planet discovered by prediction, not chance, a triumph of mathematics and human curiosity. When we gaze towards Neptune, we see more than a planet. We see a puzzle and a story of discovery. Neptune is a gateway to the unknown, a reminder that mysteries remain in our cosmic backyard. Its faint blue light is a call to adventure, inviting us to explore. The journey to understand Neptune is a testament to our relentless desire to know what lies beyond. Neptune's extremes, its cold, its winds, challenge our understanding of planetary worlds. It humbles us, reminding us of our fleeting moment in the cosmos. The universe always pushes us to look deeper, to question what we think we know. Neptune is more than the last stop in our solar system. It's a key to understanding planetary systems everywhere. Each glance at that distant blue dot is a step into the unknown. The adventure is just beginning. Neptune's discovery wasn't luck, it was a triumph of calculation. After Uranus was found, astronomers noticed its orbit was off, as if tugged by an unseen force. Two mathematicians, John Couch Adams in England and Urban Le Verrier in France, independently set out to solve the mystery. They predicted the position of a hidden planet using only math. Le Verrier sent his calculations to Berlin Observatory, telling Johann Gala exactly where to look. On September 23, 1846, Gala found Neptune less than a degree from the predicted spot. The ghostly planet was real. This was the first time a planet was discovered by prediction, not by chance. It confirmed Newton's laws worked across the vastness of space. The discovery changed astronomy forever, proving we could explore the universe with our minds as well as our eyes. Neptune's story is a testament to the power of human intellect and the elegance of mathematics. Even the emptiest patch of sky can hide a world waiting to be revealed. The universe is a puzzle, and sometimes the answers are written in numbers. Neptune's discovery opened a new way of seeing the cosmos. It showed us that the invisible can become visible through the power of thought. For over a century, Neptune was just a fuzzy blue dot, until Voyager 2 arrived in 1989. In a single day, Voyager 2 transformed our view, revealing a vibrant electric blue world. Neptune's atmosphere was alive with storms and the fastest winds in the solar system over 2,000 kilometers per hour. The great dark spot, a storm as large as Earth, raged beneath wispy white clouds. Voyager discovered Neptune radiates more than twice the energy it receives from the sun, fueling its wild weather. Scientists expected a frozen quiet world, instead they found chaos and energy. Voyager's flyby was brief, but it turned Neptune from a distant point of light into a dynamic, mysterious world. It answered some questions, but raised many more. Where does Neptune's heat come from? How do its storms form? Voyager 2 gave us our only close-up look at Neptune so far. The mysteries it revealed still challenge us. Neptune's true nature remains hidden, waiting for our return. The fleeting glimpse left us wanting more. Uranus and Neptune, two ice giants, similar in size and composition, yet strikingly different. Voyager 2 showed Uranus as calm and featureless, while Neptune was a world of storms and deep blue hues. Why is Neptune so dynamic while Uranus is so placid? The answer may lie in their internal heat. Neptune has a powerful heat source, Uranus does not. This difference drives Neptune's wild weather and leaves Uranus quiet. But why is Uranus so cold inside? Did a massive impact in its past change its fate? The contrast between these twins challenges our understanding of planetary evolution. Even small differences in history can lead to dramatic outcomes. Studying these two giants is crucial, not just for our solar system, but for understanding planets around other stars. If we can't explain our own ice giants, how can we understand the countless others in the galaxy? The tale of Uranus and Neptune is a cosmic mystery. Their differences hold clues to the diversity of worlds beyond our own. The more we learn, the more questions arise. The puzzle of the ice giants remains unsolved. Neptune, once thought isolated from the Sun, is more connected than we imagined. 
Recent Hubble observations revealed Neptune's clouds wax and wane in sync with the Sun's 11-year cycle. When the Sun is active, Neptune grows cloudier. When the Sun quiets, its skies clear. Ultraviolet light from the Sun triggers chemical reactions in Neptune's atmosphere, seeding clouds. Even at 5 billion kilometers, the Sun's faint heartbeat shapes Neptune's weather. This discovery rewrites our understanding of distant worlds. Neptune is not a static frozen planet, it breathes with the rhythm of its star. Long-term observation revealed this subtle dance. The Sun's influence reaches the edge of our solar system. Neptune's changing face is a reminder of cosmic interconnectedness. Even the farthest worlds feel the Sun's touch. Neptune's moon, Triton, is a world of strangeness and surprise. Triton orbits Neptune backward, a clue it was captured, not born there. Its surface is a patchwork of frozen plains and wrinkled terrain, with polar caps of nitrogen and methane. Voyager 2 saw geysers erupting from Triton, cryovolcanoes spewing nitrogen gas into space. Despite frigid temperatures, Triton is geologically active. Its violent capture may have melted its interior, possibly creating a hidden ocean beneath the ice. Triton's backward orbit and icy eruptions make it one of the most intriguing moons in the solar system. Could life exist in its hidden ocean? Triton is a captured wanderer, a rebel with secrets beneath its frozen shell. Its mysteries challenge our understanding of moons and planetary systems. Triton is a key to the story of Neptune and perhaps to life beyond Earth. The search for answers continues. Neptune's discovery proved we could find worlds by their gravitational whispers. That idea sparked a search for even more distant planets, like the elusive Planet Nine. Astronomers noticed odd orbits among distant Kuiper Belt objects hinting at a massive unseen planet. Planet Nine, if it exists, could be five to ten times Earth's mass. Orbiting far beyond Neptune, its gravity may be shaping the outer solar system. The hunt is on, using the same mathematical detective work that found Neptune. Finding Planet Nine would reshape our map of the solar system once again. Whether it exists or not, the search is a legacy of Neptune's discovery. The universe still holds secrets, waiting for us to uncover them. Neptune taught us to look for the invisible. The search for new worlds continues, driven by curiosity and the power of prediction. The story is far from over. Neptune is more than a distant planet. It's a laboratory for understanding worlds across the galaxy. Its storms, heat and mysterious moon Triton pose questions about how planets form and evolve. Studying Neptune helps us understand the thousands of exoplanets orbiting other stars. Voyager 2's brief flyby was just the beginning. To truly know Neptune, we must return. A dedicated orbiter could reveal its secrets, mapping its atmosphere, rings and moons, and probing Triton's hidden ocean. Neptune is a beacon at the edge of our solar system, marking the boundary between the known and the unknown. Exploring it is about understanding our place in the cosmos. Each discovery brings us closer to the story of how our solar system came to be. The faint blue light from Neptune calls to the explorer in all of us. There are still giant worlds left to explore and profound questions to answer. The journey to Neptune is a journey to understanding ourselves. The adventure continues just beyond the horizon. The cosmos awaits.